Hey, it's the Midnight Raven. Today is Sunday, the 26th of August, and I went to a vintage car show. The video for this will hopefully go up the same time as this video. Um, but I went to a vintage car show. There was pictures of cars and everything that will all appear in another video. This video is about one of the stalls that was at the vintage car show, and that was the American Candy and Sweet um, tent which I got a little bag of goodies. It doesn't look very big, but there is loads in there. So the American Candy Store, they have an actual store in Great Yarmouth, and they also visit Deerham, Thetford, Swatham, and a number of markets um, monthly or on a fortnightly basis. I'm not sure. They do seem to visit us maybe once a month. They were at the Vintage Car Show. They also do big events as well, like the Game and Country Fair um, and stuff like that. So they are around. The lady who owns the store is really sweet. Um, we've spoken loads. She knows I put her stuff on YouTube, so if she sees this, hi. Um, in here, got a load of sweets, got some drinks, got some crisps. Let's take a look. So I love American candy. I would think that Americans love British candy as well. It's just, you know, not everyone in the world gets the same sweets. Americans don't get some of the stuff we have. We don't get some that they do. So we'll dive in. So I'll show you the drink I got first. So you've seen me drink Coca Lock and Dr. Pepper, but this is Dr. Pepper Cherry. Apparently, it's really hard to get hold of and it's classed as vintage now. Vintage Dr. Pepper. Uh, the can itself was quite expensive. I believe it was like two pounds. Um, so it's not a bad price. I think it was two quid. It was one pound fifty or two pound. Unfortunately, this one doesn't have a sticker on. So it is fairly expensive for a can, but it is hard to get hold of, obviously. So Dr. Pepper Cherry. I love their Dr. Pepper Cherry. It's got that nice tang to it. What else did we get? Ooh. And then we got some combos so these are made with real cheese and these are combo baked snacks so i've never heard of these before they're cheddar cheese cracker flavored filling so that sounds kind of cool it's like a little tube and it's got like cheese flavoring on it um they're crunchy oven baked crackers with creamy cheddar cheese flavoring create the perfect hunger management snack these were four twenty nine. That shows you how hard it is to get four twenty nine for a bag of crisps. I know it sounds expensive, and it is, but stuff like this, they obviously have to import it and everything. So I haven't tried these ones before. I do have some um, other videos I've done from her American um, candy store, so I will try and link them at the end so you can see them. I have done a number of um, unbaggings from her store. Now we have some goldfish. Now these apparently in America you can get in so many flavours. Goldfish bake snack crackers. They're crackers again. And these are cheddar. I do have a thing for cheddar crisps, cheddar crackers. But I've always heard about goldfish. When you talk to American people, they talk about goldfish crackers all the time. And I've never had them. And they have some. So ah, I get to try them. These were 99p, so that's not a bad price for some crisps. I do like cheese crisps, I must say, I do like a bit of cheese. Then we have this Milky Way Midnight Dark. Now, I love dark chocolate, and this Milky Way is to die for. It's so rich and creamy. It's Milky Way Dark, it's dark chocolate, golden caramel with a vanilla nugget. Um, so that's really cool. You know, dark chocolate is is okay. It can be a bit strong for some people. I love my dark chocolate though. So dark chocolate Milky Way. It's called Midnight Dark. Like, come on. Of course I'm going to like it. <laughs> then um, the Midnight Dark, uh, that was, I believe that was £1.50. That's quite expensive for a bar of chocolate. Again, like I said, they're hard to get hold of. Then we have Tootsie Roll. Now I've had these before. I don't know if I did them in a video before, but Tootsie Rolls. Uh, these are £1.60. And these are basically, um, they're like chewy, 
They're like chewy square candies. I don't know how else to describe them. I don't know if they have a description. Not really. Um, yeah, I think you'll find they're just like chewy candies, but I've had them before. They come in these little things and they're like like chewy caramel. They're called Tootsie Roll. You can get these in two sizes as well. You can get micro ones, which are pretty cool. Um, so like I said, that's £1.60. That's not bad price. I do love my vintage sweets. Ooh. Next, we got these. Now, these are called Fluffy's Stuff Cotton Candy Pops. So, I got these for my boys. So, these are basically cotton candy lollipops. So they look like this. And they're called Fluffy Stuff Cotton Candy Artificial Flavoured Pops. So I believe I believe these were a pound each. Um, but as you can see, they they've got like cotton candy colours. You've got blue and pink, and this one's more pink than blue. Uh, but they were a pound each. I've never had these before. I thought they sounded weird to have cotton candy in a lollipop. Um, they are literally just a lollipop, but they taste of cotton candy. So my voice should absolutely love them. Me too. Then um, I do have a thing for jelly sweets as well. So I managed to get some of these jelly sweets. I'd actually seen a picture of these on their Facebook site. They do have a Facebook site. Uh, I will link their Facebook site down below if I can. And if I can link anything else, I will. So these are some ocean jellies. So these are basically just jelly shapes. This one is in the shape of like an octopus, which is kind of cool. We have a jellyfish. And the jellyfish actually matches my socks. I have jellyfish socks on, but you don't want to see my feet, do you? Yeah. Look, I actually have jellyfish. <laughs> I have jellyfish socks. And then we have this kind of weird angry fish so they're all just normal jellies they're all squidgy lit they're just three little sea creatures and then last of all um as halloween is coming up stay there um they had these other jellies that look weird and these were creepy creepy jellies and here we have what looks like this bug look at that Looks like a, I suppose it's a ladybug, but it's got these little antennas. It's like a ladybug. It just looks more creepy. And then last of all, we've got this beetle, which looks kind of cool. So they were the creepy jellies. There are only two types. If they'd have had loads of these, I'd have probably bought loads. These were 60p each. Um, and these were 60p each as well. Each of the jellies were 60p. Sounds a lot for a jelly, just one jelly. Um, but like I said, stuff like this from the, the American candy store, they have to be imported. Um, it's harder to get, um, especially through UK customs and that. So I got some ocean jellies. I got some creepy jellies. We got the candy pops. We've got a dark chocolate Milky Way and Tootsie Roll. We have the goldfish to try in cheese. We also have the combos in cheese as well. I do love cracker crisps. And we also have my favourite of the lot is the Dr Pepper cherry. Because I absolutely love Dr Pepper. So that's everything I bought. So everything in this bag came to around £14. Which isn't a bad price for a haul. Um, I do love the American Candy Store. I will try and link the other videos that I have done from there. Because um, she does know that I do these videos on YouTube. So if you're watching, hi. Um, if you want to check out their store, I will try and link their Facebook page or their store. Because they do sell items through Facebook as well. Um, they even deliver to your house if you live within a certain area as well. Or they used to, I don't know if they still do that, they used to do door-to-door -door deliveries. If you want to like and subscribe to me to see more of these, give me a big thumbs up. I do have loads of retro candy stores where I live, so I can always go get some more and we can do some more another time. I will link their other videos if I can. And if you want to see more, 
do comment down below which was your favourite item. And I will see you very soon for another video. Take care and thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Bye.